In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Immaculate Saint Jesus, have mercy on us. Let us pray. Dear Infant Jesus, your arms, arms are outstretched to, to welcome us, us here and stretched over us to bless us. us. Help Have us spend, spend this time in prayer to praise you and adore you. You, you are indeed our Lord and Saviour. You, you care for us, and because of your care for us, you are with us to hear our petitions. You then our plea and graciously grant our petitions. We humbly invoke your powerful aid and assist of you, Jesus, who lives and reigns with the Father and the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. Today we'll use petition set B. Jesus said, Ask, and you shall receive. Seek, and you shall find. Knock, and it shall be opened to you. With faith in this providence, let us bring our petitions to him. For an increased awareness and protection of marriage as a divine institution between one man and one woman. Hear us, O miraculous infant Jesus. For all married couples, may their lives together bear witness to the beauty of married life as a participation in God's love and encourage those discerning this vocation. Hear us, O miraculous infant Jesus. For all those suffering from troubled or broken marriages, may they come to know healing and forgiveness through the Father's endless love. Hear us, O miraculous infant Jesus. For all expectant mothers and fathers, that they be encouraged and supported in their roles as educators and primary role models of Christian living for their children. Hear us, O miraculous infant Jesus. For couples desiring children, that their love may bear fruit in virtue, and may they enjoy the company of their offspring in God's time. Hear us, O miraculous infant Jesus. For couples bearing the cross of infertility, that they be comforted by the maternal embrace of the Mother of God and be blessed with spiritual fruitfulness. Hear us, O miraculous infant Jesus. We pray for our own personal intentions. O oh Jesus, you said, Ask, Ask and, and you shall receive, receive seek, seek and, and you shall find, find knock and, and it shall be opened. Through, through the intercession of Mary, your, your most holy mother, mother I, knock, I knock, I seek, I, seek, I ask that my, that my prayer be, be granted. O oh Jesus, you said, all, All that you ask, ask of the Father in my name, name grant you. you. Through the intercession of Mary, your most holy mother, I humbly and urgently ask your Father in your name that my prayer will be granted. O oh Jesus, you said, Heaven, Heaven and earth shall pass away, but my word shall not pass away. Through the intercession of Mary, your most holy mother, I feel confident that my prayer will be granted. Let us pray for the intentions of our Holy Father, Pope Francis. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen.
Glory be, be to, to the, the Father, Father and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, Spirit as, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Let us pray. O infant Jesus, I know, I know you, you love me and, and would never leave me. I thank you for your presence in my life. Miraculous infant, I believe in your promise of peace, blessings, and freedom from want. I place every need and care in your hands. Lord Jesus, may I always trust in your generous mercy and love. I want to honor and praise you now and forever. Amen. Two thanksgivings. The following are the petitions. Number one, for healing, guidance on job search, and providing food for a family, my family. Number two, successful cataract operation for healing, protection, and speedy recovery. Number three, praying for a responsible for responsible guidance and caring and good family. And number four. Uh, for students taking the year end PSLE, that they would pass with flying colors and be protected from the COVID 19 infection. The following two are the thanksgivings. One, dear infant Jesus, thank you so much for being always by my side, no matter how often I fall into sin. And thank you for bringing into my life people who are able to help keep up my physical and mental well being. And the next one, thank you for sending good people to pray and bless all these good persons with good health, graces, and your protection. Thank you for your letters. Please keep them coming. And uh, today we would share on article number 2560, 2560 from the Catechism of the Catholic Church. And uh, this will be our ongoing catechesis for your benefit. I will read for this article 2560. If you knew the gift of God, the wonder of prayer is revealed beside the well where we come seeking water. There, Christ comes to meet every human being. It is he who first seeks us and asks us for a drink. Jesus thirsts. His asking arises from the depths of God's desire for us. Whether we realize it or not, prayer is the encounter of God's thirst with ours. God thirsts that we may thirst for him. The passage of this article that refers to the well is, of course, in St. John's Gospel, 
Jesus' encounter with the Samaritan woman who comes at noon to draw water from the well. The woman, as we know, was a sinner and she, re she draws water at the 12th noon because nobody will be there to talk to her. This particular passage is also the favourite of our foundress, St. Teresa of Avila, and she uses this to also draw the image of the way, the four ways of drawing water in her four, in her description of how prayer can be understood. Primarily, this particular article is to tell us that God is always the initiator of every good gift, even for prayer. And God is the one who initiates the conversation with the woman at the well, just as he would also be the initiator somehow when we do pray. This may come as a surprise, because it seems as if we are the one talking all the time and he doesn't respond. But we believe that even this desire of prayer is his gift, so that we can also grow into our desire for him. A thirst must be matched with the appropriate substance that quenches the thirst, right? If we are thirsty, some of us would drink the coke as to quench the thirst. Some of us would drink coffee. But really, whatever we drink must be something that would satisfy us. God, by his nature, is love. And thus God, who is love and gives of himself in love, would then receive how to say, we want to get the response of love, being loved in return. And thus the thirst of God for love is that of our loving Him. Thus God's thirst represents His desire for us to respond back to Him totally. God never loves any one of us half-heartedly. And the response of prayer as a encounter with him in thirst in terms of thirst has to also become a wholehearted encounter back in return of love. So that thirst in itself is also a process. We would learn how much God thirsts for us when we also start to love him intensely and also in a very deliberate we continue with our prayer.
Today we'll pray the litany of the most holy name of Jesus. Lord have mercy. Lord have mercy. Christ have mercy. Christ have mercy. Lord have mercy. Lord have mercy. Christ hear us. Christ hear us. Christ graciously hear us. Christ graciously hear us. God the Father of heaven, have mercy on us. God the Son, Redeemer of the world, have mercy on us. God the Holy Spirit, have mercy on us. Holy Trinity, one God, have mercy on us. Jesus, Son of the living God, have mercy on us. Jesus, Splendor of the Father, have mercy on us. Jesus, brightness of eternal light, have mercy on us. Jesus, King of glory, have mercy on us. Jesus, Son of justice, have mercy on us. Jesus, Son of the Virgin Mary, have mercy on us. Jesus, most amiable, have mercy on us. Jesus, most admirable, have mercy on us. Jesus, the mighty God, have mercy on us. Jesus, Father of the world to come. Have mercy on us. Jesus, Angel of great counsel. Have mercy on us. Jesus, most powerful. Have mercy on us. Jesus, most patient. Have mercy on us. Jesus, most obedient. Have mercy on us. Jesus, meek and humble of heart. Have mercy on us. Jesus, lover of chastity. Have mercy on us. Jesus, our lover. Have mercy on us. Jesus, God of peace. Have mercy on us. Jesus, author of life. Have mercy on us. Jesus, model of virtues. Have mercy on us. Jesus, zealous for souls. Have mercy on us. Jesus, our God. Have mercy on us. Jesus, our refuge. Have mercy on us. Jesus, father of the poor. Have mercy on us. Jesus, treasure of the faithful. Have mercy on us. Jesus, Good Shepherd, have mercy on us. Jesus, True Light, have mercy on us. Jesus, Eternal Wisdom, have mercy on us. Jesus, Infinite Goodness, have mercy on us. Jesus, Our Way and Our Life, have mercy on us. Jesus, Joy of the Angels, have mercy on us. Jesus, King of the Patriarchs, have mercy on us. Jesus, Master of the Apostles, have mercy on us. Jesus, Teacher of the Evangelists, have mercy on us. Jesus, Strength of Martyrs, have mercy on us. Jesus, light of confessors. Have mercy on us. Jesus, purity of virgins. Have mercy on us. Jesus, crown of all saints. Have mercy on us. Be merciful. Spare us, O Jesus. Be merciful. Graciously spare us, O Jesus. From all evil. Deliver us, O Jesus. From all sin. Deliver us, O Jesus. From your wrath. Deliver us, O Jesus. From the snares of the devil. Deliver us, O Jesus. From the spirit of fornication. Deliver us, O Jesus. From everlasting death. Deliver us, O Jesus. From the neglect of your inspirations. <laughs> Deliver us, O Jesus, through the mystery of your holy incarnation. Deliver us, O Jesus, through your nativity. Deliver us, O Jesus, through your infancy. Deliver us, O Jesus, through your most divine life. Deliver us, O Jesus, through your labors. Deliver us, O Jesus, through your agony and passion. Deliver us, O Jesus, through your cross and dereliction. Deliver us, O Jesus, through your sufferings. Deliver us, O Jesus, through your death and burial. Deliver us, O Jesus, through your resurrection. Deliver us, O Jesus, through your ascension. Deliver us. O oh Jesus, through your institution of the most holy Eucharist, deliver us, O oh Jesus, through your joys, deliver us, O oh Jesus, through your glory, deliver us, O oh Jesus, Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, spare us, O oh Lord, Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world, graciously hear us, O oh Lord, Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world, have mercy on us, Jesus, hear us. Jesus, hear us. Jesus, graciously hear us. Jesus, graciously hear us. Let us pray.
Lord Jesus Christ, you said, Ask and you shall receive, seek and you shall find, knock and it shall be opened to you. Mercifully attend to our supplications and grant us the grace of your most divine love, that we may love you with all our hearts, in all our words and actions, and never cease to praise you. Make us, O Lord, to have a perpetual fear and love of your holy name, for you never fail to govern those whom you establish in your love, you who live and reign for ever and ever. Amen. Let us pray. O God, who in this wonderful sacrament have left us a memorial of your passion, grant us, we pray, so to revere the sacred mysteries of your body and blood, that we may always experience in ourselves the fruits of your redemption. You live and reign forever and ever. Amen. Blessed be God, blessed be his holy name. Blessed be Jesus Christ, true God and true man. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Blessed be his most sacred heart. Blessed be his most precious heart. Blessed be Jesus in the most holy sacrament of the altar. Blessed be the Holy Spirit, the Paraclete. Blessed be the Great Mother of God, Mary Most Holy. 
Let's be her holy and immaculate conception. Let's be her glorious assumption. Let's be the name of Mary, Virgin and Mother. Let's be Saint Joseph, her most chaste spouse. Let's be God in his angels and in his saints.